Am I the friend? Okay. Oh, you know, girl who is getting in touch with friends after school. Girl, I support you, but how do you know this person actually would for you? If you're this chocho, so okay. Yes. Like, you do with toxic friends. Who do you want to order what you cannot take? Because yeah. you're a toxic friend, you might be the toxic one. Do you know why are you looking tacky? So, girl. I'm oh, a girl's girl. girl. I love you. Know me. You know, like I like you also. Yes. Tell you me. Are you a witch? Yeah, witch. <laughs> Love yours. Am I the same? Hi guys. Hi my lords. Hi guys. How are you guys doing? It's been a while, I know. So today, from the title, we're going to talk about, you know, girl stuff. Help me welcome my beautiful, nice, pleasant, adorable Ayesha. <laughs> Hi girl! Hi baby! How are you? I'm okay. Hey. Thanks for coming. Yeah, thank you for having me. So guys, if you're just seeing my face for the first time, my name is Bibi Tayo. I'm a final year student. Hello! Hello. <laughs> final year student, not even under the final year, part 5 student. Hello! I'm from my own lower university. No part 4. No part 4, part you know. Part 5. Please introduce yourself. Hi everyone, my name is Ayoife and um, I'm friends with Bibi. The title, we are saying we're going to talk about girl talk. Talking about random stuff, you know, things that are LD in female friendships and things that are not, things girls do that we don't like, and things, you know, that is just lovely about being a girl, you know, girlhood. So, and it's going to be a very interactive one because I trust my girl here. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, without no further ado, let's just get into, into the video. But that's it. <laughs> so, guys, let's start. So, babes. Yes. How are you doing? I'm okay, thank you. I like to like hacks. How are you feeling? How is life? <laughs> I feel very good. Life is good. Not mm-hmm. perfect, but great. Mm, okay. The first thing I'm going to ask, we're going to talk about, it's not even a question, it's going to be like a chit chat, you know. Right. So it's like how to stay in touch with friends after school. <sighs> because it's going to happen to us soon, guys. To be very honest. <laughs> so for me, what I think about that, Mm. See, we have not even started for five years, and I'm already so burdened about what after school will look like, I'm telling you. and all of those things. Yes. But I think that you cannot help but lose friends. I'm being very practical. Okay. You will really lose some friends. You cannot help it. I feel like it's going to take a lot of intentionality mm-hmm. to still be friends with some people. A lot of it, because people will go to different locations, some yeah, people exactly. will leave the country. You will, have things to do. You will not Come have on. things to do. Even sometimes. And then when it happens like that over time, catching up might even be awkward because you really don't have anything that is happening at the moment to discuss. Yeah, so, exactly. but, so I think it is inevitable. But if someone mm. puts intentional, if you are intentional, I think yeah. you will still think, at least even if it's not physically mm-hmm. online, you can always stay in touch and just... So that's right. But do you know something like, even you guys might be best of friends in school mm-hmm. because probably because you have things to discuss in common, like, oh, girl, the class... Girl, have you done your assignment? Mm-hmm. But something just happened that I noticed that some friends that even when you're on holiday, you guys might not talk to like school regimes because there's really no so the thing is that I feel like we have different friends for different yeah. reasons. Mm-hmm. Yeah, of course. My closest friend is even in my faculty, mm. to be very honest. Yeah, so exactly. I feel like we all have you know somebody that their presence in their life is very, very important in your academics yeah. and you know that okay, this person this person is my friend, right? But most importantly for my academics, this person is my friend exactly. so to so take it beyond that mm-hmm. i feel like you people we need to go from just faculty like oh what are you doing today yeah, and do you mind if you go to like the cinema that's how you build up school. just yeah, outside yeah. academics yeah. yeah i think that works too so how do you know if someone genuinely supports you like genuinely you know there are all, all these like girls i see you girl i support you but how do you know if this person actually would for you even when you are not in the room let me say this no be all this church church i'm telling you <laughs> show your kids show your kids yes. like you, you don't you don't support with your mouth yeah be practical about it exactly. you support my business come when i'm having when i'm at a trade fair yeah buy from me yeah. tell people about even me like you can't afford what i sell to be very even if it's once in your lifetime that get, support yeah. tell people about my brand like it's not like just i like, support you go girl go, go girl, girl but you are just like, no. I, like i'm you not i'm not saying you have to like patronize me every time but every you know, time yes but there are some things you can just do you yeah can many times that like, for example i have a friend that makes slides yeah many times so i'm not even trying to say anything you would think she's the owner of the band to be very honest like i carry it on my my head like, if like, i post for her 
I think I'm even doing better for business she's than I am for my own business. And it's not even only ah. Uh, if she posts for me too, be very I can't look at the many how many customers she has given me so far. Like so that's just so, it's not it's not just by mouth. You I have put a to, brand there, so you guys patronize my girl. You, my love. <laughs> so you have to actually yeah, go all the way out. Exactly, and you know, so loyalty. How to deal with toxic friends? How do you deal with toxic friends? Oh, so I've not really had terrible experiences with friendship, friendship. in okay. my life. Okay. And I will not say I've had so many friends, but okay. for the few friends I have, mm-hmm. I've not had any really bad friends. But so I don't, I don't, I will not say I have a toxic, so. I've had a toxic relationship with any one of my friends, but I've had a close one. And then it took me a lot because I love, I love that person so much. So, yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. It took me a lot to eventually be able to let go. I have oh. to talk to my sister. My sister is like, okay, it's as if you're not seeing that this person is not good for is you. not your friend, but you. Uh, you consider the you consider her to be your friend, but she does not consider you to be her friend. Check. So I don't want to go into details because the person might know. Yeah. So yeah, I've not really had toxic experiences okay. with friends. But if you're if you're having if anybody's having toxic anything, please. But in my own please. opinion, I feel like I don't want to be judgy and be like like charges attract. But I feel like sometimes it might probably be the toxic friend. Like you. You okay. think you're a toxic friend. You might be the toxic one. Do you know that case? I, I, that. I understand. You know, it's not like, do you get what I'm saying? Like, some people will be like, she's too toxic. But deep down, we know that you, yourself, you, you, you are toxic. But one thing about me is that I don't really, if you are toxic, I'm going to, I don't, I don't, I don't do like this. I'm so really going probably, to tell you your friends. Just like, me, if you're having issues with your friends, yeah. I'm going to tell you the problem. Exactly, exactly. So exactly. I, I just feel like, on my own case, I'll just look around. I'll be like, why do I attract this dirty person? Like, why do I? Do you know what I'm saying? What am I doing that makes you want to be my friend in the first place? Like, am I like toxic? I would just look around myself and be like, maybe I'm doing something that makes you think that we are alike. We For are you like, to bring that toxic, toxicity to my corner and stuff Actually, like that. Talk to you and you're like, I don't know what you're saying, but I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. <laughs> no, you cannot, you cannot be talking to me. I'm Why you this to me? I'm not, I'm not the one for you. No. Why do you even think that? So like, I'm the right person for you. Why? Why are you even like, trying? Do you, you don't want to stand the chance. <laughs> exactly. So the next one is, how do you set, how do you set boundaries in everything, like in friendship? Mm, you know, I've learned before I even. I've never really had any bad experience, really. Yeah. I, I learned since I was in Predig. When I was going to Predig, because my mm. sister was already in OA, she told me that don't try to be very friendly with your roommates. So, yeah. Because if you start cooking together and all of those, oh, it will end in tears. Don't do it. So, I really, really had boundaries. So, mm. when I got to part one, I was a roommate that you did not take my pure water without asking. <laughs> exactly. I was that person. And for you, that's just like boundaries. I was a roommate that will not, I cannot fetch water and you will be scooping a bella. And it's not because I'm wicked, really. I was very, very you nice. I did not have, I never had issues with any of my roommates mm-hmm. in part one. So I drew the line clear. Yeah, and yeah. also, very importantly, when you're drawing your boundaries, mm-hmm. you do not do unto others what you cannot take because yeah. people will not respect exactly. your boundaries. Exactly. Perfect. Like, that's just the word. Like, you cannot expect people to, like, respect your boundaries. Where obviously you, you, you don't even respect people. For example, boundaries. Yeah. You, you cook your food, you don't want somebody to eat it. But when somebody when cooks, cooks yeah, you, you exactly. don't take the food in their pots. Yeah. Yeah. No and just some people like I know I know people like me. Yeah. I give compliments a lot. Like if I see you, oh, I love your hair. Oh my God. People, do you get what I'm oh saying? Yeah. So and I take compliments as a big deal. I'm just like it's not that I, I, I know as to like no, some people are just they're just bad. Like they just talk anyhow. Mm-hmm. Because I don't know why you never say anything. If I wear something that looks good, you mm-hmm. don't compliment me. But maybe on a day, probably I'm having like a rough air day, or maybe my clothes is not looking my best. That's you'll be the first person to point it out. Like, why are you looking tacky? So that's one thing I used to first thing I said with my friendship that if you're not going to be there to hype me up, don't come don't and come, don't criticize me. You get like you don't have the, you don't have that right. You keep don't your, have it. Keep your keep for you. <laughs> but really, I think that I like getting compliments. I think everybody does. But to be very honest, when I get compliments, because boys, mm-hmm. it's okay if you compliment me. Some of them are genuine, but yeah. I feel my best when I get a compliment from a lady. Stop and there. that's why every day, sometimes mm-hmm. your compliment is what somebody needs to make their entire day. For they might real, be feeling real, so right? not confident and mm-hmm. they just, oh my God, you look so good. You just graced the entire day with your words. Just, so just 
five bucks. I'm really, really I'm big on that. And I will not flatter you if you don't look good. I, I, say, I will not flatter you. But if you look I wanna, good, I will not keep quiet until I like If you. I notice your new nails, I'm going to mention it. Like did you make your hair? You look so you. good. Who like did it for you? Like you have a new dress. Oh my I like god! Your hair, by the way. Thank you, my love. I like your <laughs> thing. Everything, everything. You get yeah. So that's just it. So this one says how to move on from friendship that don't serve you anymore. Let me take that. Okay, girl. They don't serve you. So what are you still doing there? What? Like, they are not even doing anything for you. So, but how do you, to be practical about it, how do you, how do I move on from friendship? Firstly, I detach. That's mm-hmm. one, one thing I do. I will try to detach. I'll let you know that I'm not here anymore. Okay. So from there, I work on myself, like emotionally, because even no matter, it, it might be just be friendship, but it has to do with emotions too. Do you get like, mm-hmm. at some point they were there for you, there will be some things you guys do together that you that can't you anymore and you will definitely miss those things. So, I'll try to detach first. And when I say detach, I will... I will but when you say detach, it's very easy to say detach. Yeah. How do you actually go about detaching? Because mm. it's not easy, yo. Mm. And then, break up from your relationship might hurt. But friends break should... up hurts a lot. They don't talk a lot. about it for you. A lot. For you. Because these are your ride or dies at some point. Like, you guys will like... So, like... I try to like detach in a way that probably like yeah we used to talk often in a way I will reduce that okay. because there are some things you do that will just make me know that this thing does not help me probably you are hurting me with your words mm-hmm. you might be hurting me with your vibe and then I feel like we can always talk over it so you maybe yeah, push yeah. me to the wall and I'm exactly, like no, this is exactly, exactly where yeah. I draw the line but you know when you, when you get to that space that you just need that I don't need this anymore. Mm-hmm. There are some friends that will just bring, they always bring issues. Yeah. Like, the only Honestly. thing they bring to your corner, like, to your life is... If you examine, you're yeah. like, what have you actually contributed? Nothing, like, nothing, nothing. So, what about you? How do you do that? I've never had this experience. So, I really don't know. But I feel like if I'm done with somebody... To be honest, I feel like being my face, yeah. I won't see you. Mm. So, that's just it. I mm. will greet you because I'm not... I, I don't like keeping my list. We're going to greet, but mm. no conversations. I'm not going yeah. to engage anything yeah, or anything. Exactly, like, no. Exactly. But do you, do you really think women love... Genuinely love each other? Yes, I do. Yeah. Speaking Same. for myself... For real... For I'm real. a girl's girl. Like, I love women. I'm not a lesbian. For but life, I love women for so much. I love women so <laughs> much. <laughs> like, yes. I love women so much. Yeah. Many times, right, mm. I have friends that are boys. Mm. And then a lot of them, maybe not a lot of them, but mm. sometimes you see them having conversation that, ah, baby, ought to travel. Sometimes I'm like, do you not realize that somebody can travel with their money? There are people that are legit, like, I'm always trying to defend. And then some of them are like, oh, okay, I don't, don't, don't want to build this sexist talk. Honestly. Yeah, because I don't. Because I'm that. always out here so, defending the girls. Like, yo, people work hard. How are them enjoy? You don't always have to attribute but, everything like, to a man. One thing I say often is that I go hard a lot. Like, if you know me, you know, like I like to also. Mm-hmm. It might not even come I from a place of. That. <laughs> I to can't. Be honest, it might not come from a place of hunger, but making my own money makes me happy. True, and yeah, the yeah, fact yeah. that I love what I do. So when I go out for my business, I go all out and all of that. Mm-hmm. In the future, I never buy a Bentley. My dream car. Someone with that. Although I don't mind if a man dies for me. I'm not even trying to invalidate a man's place in my life. Yeah. If my man will make my life easier. Yeah. Very very fine. But will I? I might not do. Maybe you might not do as well as you would with your man. Yeah. But trust me, I'll be very comfortable. You get very very comfortable. I feel like women actually love each other. I'm a girl's girl. And I like. I, I like the fact that. This girl's girl thing can be so cliche, like can, can be, so be do you get can like, be really so fake and girls can be like I'm a girl's girl, but deep down But I feel like the problem with girls is jealousy. I know how jealousy sprouts. Mm-hmm. It's like for example, you are friends with somebody, maybe when yeah. you're in part one, you mm-hmm. both were broke and yeah, maybe so. part two comes, part three, somebody yeah. starts doing better than another. Yeah. Maybe you're both doing better, but someone is doing better. better than you. I feel like that doing well in life actually puts your friendship to test. Mm. So some people cannot. Some people want to do better, but they they cannot stand you doing better than than them. them. So why is it like that? It's not supposed to be. Why? Why is it like that? If you actually would for me. My God should always make you happy. See, when you are doing the same for you. If my friend is doing well, I'm so happy to be in your circle. I enjoy the benefit of association. And it will, yeah. it will motivate me to do better. Do you like, get, do you get what I'm example, saying? if I have a friend, let's, maybe this is extreme, but if I have a friend yeah. that maybe is lucky and then 
she gets she does a business and then she gets recognition by celebrities and all of that mm. you know the celebrities yes, indirectly yeah. i know these people because mm. i know you mm-hmm. so it's not supposed to be a big deal i've seen people break up out of friendship because somebody's doing better you're jealous somebody got a better man than you why are you angry it doesn't make any sense for real why why are you are you a witch yes Tell stuff you, to me. Are you a witch, you're a witch. <laughs> to be a witch because why can't you if i see something that i like as a man it gets to you sometimes i'll be like ah yes I just my own to become definitely that feeling that, i will not be happy for yeah, you when that feeling comes you just be like i'm not going to dwell on it let it go let it go like because you don't know what they did to get to that spot to everybody has a story it might look all glamour on the outside but deep down everybody has a story to tell mm-hmm. if you ask everybody i have like even the billionaire children if you ask them their trouble you might not be your own trouble like our own trouble might be money money might not be their own issue but they, but they do have had issues do you yes. get that's one thing that i believe about life and i feel like you should not be jealous of your friends you know like, it's a very disgusting it's, it's very unnecessary for them just be happy so yeah how to actually make amazing friends IFA, let me let me give you guys like background here. IFA is very good with people. Like IFA is my classmate. She's my friend. I, she's my friend. She's my classmate. She's a very sweet girl. And I'm saying this about her. And we are like over how many in our class? 500. If they call 200 people, they'll say the same thing about her. So we really need tips from her. IFA, <laughs> how do you actually do it? She's so good with everybody. I'm not even like trying to like. She's very good with everybody. Like if you if you ask people about IFA, that's what they'll say. That sweet girl. That I think that's just the energy she gives. Oh like that girl. doesn't give that that sweet girl, like because she's always like ugly people. Hi, hey, 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 hey. How do you do, it, babes? I, I think, think first of all, it's mm-hmm. just in my okay. It's in my nature. But before you, it used to be so so hidden. Like when I was in part one, I was not so. I was very very. I was always very quiet. I've mm. had people come to me. I've had people tell my sister that I like your sister, but she's she doesn't so, even smile. Yeah. She's always like this, and I'm like, you. <laughs> but not everybody will get the chance to come close enough to you to discover that you're actually a sweet person. You mm-hmm. have to look like it on the outside. So mm-hmm. I'm, I don't even think I'm being intentional about it, but I feel like it has just become my person. Like, oh my god, hi, I want to hug you, and then another thing that makes me like that mm-hmm. There's one thing that I've, I live with every day. You never know when your last time will be with any anybody. Hmm. Make sure that you have no regret of any... Like, you don't have any regret. That you Somebody will now be like, oh my God, I wish I helped them the last like, time. I wish I did this the last hmm. time. Like, give out all the love you have. Oh my God, you look so good. Like, hmm. so that even if anything happens and then you lose somebody that yeah. you're like, oh my God, there was nothing I could have done better. Like, yeah. really, it's so sad, but I love you for life. And you know... So yeah, That's I feel it. like on my own part, I just feel like you don't have to be fake about it. Mm-hmm. I'm, 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 I'm a believer of vibe comes naturally. Like when you see somebody that you naturally connect with, it will just click. Do you right. get like you right. don't have to like try to force it and be like because this person you want to be their friend. You don't do. You, Get what I'm trying to explain. Like I understand. I don't want to call. It, I don't want to say farms in per se, but maybe get, farms in. Fa- do you get farm? Exactly. That's the word. So when you see people that you actually want to be their friend, you don't have to go outside your way to be their friend. Right. Do you get like you guys will you connect. can't be friends with everybody. You can't really. and blend that. That's the problem with Nigeria. You can't be friends with everybody. We try to be friends with everybody. Just what right. do you get? The fact that you're my, my classmate makes your friend that and what like. You might, you guys might be neighbors for years, and you guys do not leave that neighbor face. But Nigerians, yeah. we have like this, um, we always greeting each other. You try to be friend. That's where the issue comes in. Once, once you know that everybody cannot be your friend, you guys might be cool, but yeah, not but friends. everybody cannot be your friend. Yes. Do you get? So everybody that's cannot. just. I think I just got you that. And I feel like one thing is that you might like that. I would like for this person to be my friend, but if you check yourself, like you check yourself and you check the person, you yeah. know that. Even if it works, it will not last. Do you get so don't even stress. You might not really, really, really like them. From far, I say this thing for even for my male friends that most time you try to impress someone deep down, deep down. You might even be the one that you are saving. You are the, you are even the bigger one. Yeah, like you, are, you have a lot to lose than them mm-hmm. than you think. You trying to be their friend, you might think that oh, if your friend is going to, deep down, you have a lot to lose than them. So most time, just don't force it and let it go naturally. Sometimes they're not even looking out to be friends with anybody, and it just happens. 
Cool. Yeah, like, how do you even become friends? To be very honest, I don't even know. I explain. I cannot explain honestly. And we just get to like always in sync with this and all of that. So that's just it. I feel like I have no more questions for you. Do you have anything to say? Uh, to do I have anything to say? I don't have anything to say. But on a closing note, yeah. if you're a bad girl, not bad girl, yeah. but if you're a bad person, please stop being a bad person. Be a girl's girl. Like, protect the girls. girls. Like, yeah. don't join people to talk bad about girls. girls. Like, always stand there to defend. Be good to your friends. And then there's something about some people. Let me just say this. Yeah. Some people are not... I don't know if you know people like this. Uh-huh. The people that are their friends, go, go, they've seen them finish. So you will not find them doing anything. For example, you have a friend that's very close to you. You say, yeah. but your brother, they don't give you anything. Because yeah. like, yeah. But there's not another person. Something. People that they don't will not buy them sometimes. You're like, what's going on here? So like, you should really, 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 really stop. Be a good girl. Be a good friend. Please. Just be good general and as a girl try to do something for yourself you know like very the society actually do, don't recognize women's efforts very like, important to try to like make do with something with your life don't let your life to have be something to, you are doing to a man or to, to anybody to anybody be able in general, to do well by yourself self, like have your own identity as very a girl. important that's just your, it. like let that's there be something it that you have for yourself something tangible right if it's business if it's degree if it's school if it's anything it anything. can be anything just do Have something your in your life that's, and, you that's know. you and godspeed and as you know this channel is a girl supporting channel i know some guys will be like why right, girls girl, girl okay we support men too we are not we anti- have said anything by we, we love men we love men yeah, and we love, we love good men we love good, good men very actually. important good men. Good, men. good men so yeah so Thank you so much, guys, for watching my video. Thank and thank you, my that. girl, for coming. I love you so much. I love you too so <laughs> much. So, see you guys in the next one. And I hope you liked my video. I'm going to put IFS Instagram and our business page here, right? Yeah, thank you so, so much. yeah, thank you so much. Please like, share, subscribe to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you guys. You're not going to die if you subscribe. Please, guys. Share the link. Thank you so much. Bye. We love you.